In this video, I will show you how to create an animated NFT using AI. And after that, we are going to sell it on three different marketplaces. I have left all of the links for you to follow along down below so that you don't have to be a AI coder or a blockchain developer. And as a cherry on top of all of this, I am doing a YouTube giveaway. I will be giving away one month of my YouTube revenue to the winner of the NFT trading contest. If you're interested in becoming an NFT trader and participating in the contest, link for you down below. To create our animated AI NFT, we are going to be using some complex Python code. Now, luckily, Google has created Google Colab, which is an online tool that allows us to run Python code without any configuration and using Google GPUs. So if you click on the link down below and open up the Google Colab sheet that I have created for you, you will be able to follow along and not need to create any of the code, but you can also fine tune and modify the code that I have created and that I have uploaded so that you can adjust it however you want. The first step, in this code is going to be to download all of the requirements that we need for the AI animator. To do this, all we have to do is hover over the play button and click on the download button or the play button. This is going to download a series of different libraries. Now there is an option for you to fine tune, should you choose to, you can select a different model. Once all of the libraries have been downloaded, the next step is to configure the AI animator. We can set the width and the height and the frames, and we can also set up some other parameters, such as the text that we are going to use to animate our image, and also some animation parameters you can fine tune this however you like. I suggest that you play around with them and see how they work. The next step is to fire up the AI animator and see the different images that it's going to produce. The way that this code is going to work, it's going to produce uh, different images at an interval of one minute more or less between each other. Now, once you have enough images to create a short video, the following part of the code is going to combine all of these images into an animation. As you can see here, I have already downloaded or I have already generated hundreds of different images starting from my text sentence. My text sentence was a giant robot in a universe of PCs or computers. Uh, this has generated already 100 images or so. I have left it for uh, an hour or so to generate all of these images. And as I scroll down, I can see the evolution or how the algorithm is evolving over time and generating a different image. We can download each one of these images by right-clicking on them and saving them as. Now, let's put them all together inside of a video. This video is going to combine all of the images that we have generated and create a short animation for us. Remember, the more images that you generate and the more algorithm run, the longer the video is going to be. In this case, the video is 16 seconds. And you can see it that this is the animation that we have created. It's an evolution of the algorithm or of the, of the art. And we can see how the algorithm, the AI algorithm is evolving and changing over time to produce a different picture. Now, if I were to let this run for a very long time, I would probably get a giant robot in a universe of computers. The next step in here is to download our video on our computer. And once we have downloaded the video, the next step will be to sell our video. But just before that, let's review our finished product and see what we think about it. So this is the animation. It is in a quite high quality and we can see that uh, it's a pretty cool animation. So now let's go sell it on three different marketplaces. All right, now that our NFT is ready, let's sell it on OpenSea. OpenSea is the biggest NFT marketplace and I'm sure it's pretty straightforward how to use it for everybody. We have to create a MetaMask wallet or any kind of Ethereum wallet that will allow us to sign into OpenSea. Now we can upload different kinds of NFTs, meaning that we can create images, JPEGs, all kinds of different files. In this example, we are going to be using an MP4. So our art has been created with an MP4 format. So we're going to be selling an animated movie as an NFT. Now let's create a cool title for our NFT. So I will be using the sentence that I have used when creating this NFT. So that is a giant robot in a universe of computers. I will also add a couple of other description 
uh, just to make my NFT a little bit more complete. And make sure that once you're creating your NFTs, all of the information that you insert is accurate. Why? Because afterwards you will not be able to edit this information once you commit and you decide to sell it. Now, one little suggestion, we also need a a GIF or a JPEG for our preview image. So I have converted the MP4 into a GIF using an online tool. I have left the links to that tool down in the description below. So now that we have everything ready, we can create our NFT. This process that we've just gone through, creating all of this information and uploading the image and uh, the GIF, this is all getting packaged by OpenSea into an NFT and being deployed on the Polygon blockchain. Now make sure that we have, uh, that we have selected the Polygon blockchain because that is going to allow us to sell our NFT for free. We haven't completed yet this process. The next step to do is to decide the price that we wanna sell our NFT for. We're gonna be selling it with on Ethereum so we can list any amount of Ethereum that we think our NFT is worth. In this example, uh, I will be inserting 0.04 Ethereum. We also have the ability to select the duration of the uh, sale that we want to make. So in this example, it's going to I'm going to keep it default and leave it at seven days. We can also see that the fee for using the OpenSea is going to be 2.5% of the total sale of this NFT. Now we're going to click on complete listing, and this is going to generate the NFT contract that we require. Uh, to, the, to be deployed on the blockchain. Now, this is amazing because OpenSea is doing all of this work for us. Uh, OpenSea is creating the NFT contract, is deploying it on the blockchain for us, and all of this without requiring any gas fees because we're using the Polygon blockchain. Polygon blockchain is a layer two build blockchain on the Ethereum blockchain. So let's sign this connection and uh, Right now, we are unlocking the currency that is going to allow us to sell and to list this NFT also for free. Now, once we sign this, this is going to be the last step that is going to authorize OpenSea to sell this NFT on behalf of our wallet. Now that the transaction is signed, our NFT has been listed and is ready for sale to the world. Now, if we go back to our NFT, we can see that our NFT is for sale at 0.04 Ethereum with all of the different information down in the links below. Notice one thing that our NFT was added to a collection, an untitled collection in this example. That is the contract to which all of our NFTs that we are going to create belong to. So uh, if you edit this collection, you can go to this collection and edit it and uh, once you have edited, it will look a little bit more professional and it will explain and give the information regarding the NFTs that are contained on that collection. Remember, a collection is just an NFT contract that contains other NFT contracts. So that's it. That's it for OpenSea. Let's move on to the next one. Next, we are going to mint and sell our NFT on Mintable. Mintable is an amazing platform. However, it does allow, require you to sign up with an account before you can mint your NFTs. So we're going to sign up with our email and then connect our MetaMask wallet so that we are ready to go. What is going to happen is that once we connect our MetaMask wallet and once we have created an account, Mintable is going to link our email with our wallet to try to provide more transparency and security for the platform. So once you link your wallet and you sign the transaction that is going to authenticate that your wallet belongs to your account, now you're ready to mint an NFT on Mintable. So once you click done, you are all set. We are going to mint our NFT with zero gas fees. There is different options for minting it on different blockchains such as Immutable X, which is a different blockchain than Ethereum and it supports zero gas fees. In this example that we are going to be using, we are gonna, leave, we are gonna put the gas fees on the buyer of the NFT. Therefore, this is going to allow us to list our NFT for free on Mintable without having to pay anything and being able to sell it immediately. So we're gonna fill out the information that is required for our NFT, such as the description, uh, the long description, which is always going to be a giant robot in a universe of computers. And as a listing subtitle, I will add an AI masterpiece, which is uh, which is actually has this image has been generated by an AI masterpiece. Therefore, it is quite spot on. The next thing that we are going to do is we're going to upload our GIF and we're also going to upload our uh, movie file. 
Now that we have everything and I have also inserted the description, now we can sell our NFT. There is three different options, a fixed price, a bid and a bid with a buy now button. Now we're going to just go with the simple auction and we're just going to go with an auction and we're going to set this auction at a default of 12 hours. Now we can set different prices. We can set any kind of price that we want for our NFT to sell. In this case, we're going to be selling a 0.02 Ethereum or 0.01 ETH and selling it like that. The last thing that we have to do is click on list item and this is going to insert our NFT. Have us sign the transaction with our NFT, uh, with our MetaMask wallet. And like this, we have successfully listed our NFT for sale on Mintable. That is amazing. That is just great because we have just for free listed created our nft out of our ai algorithm and we have listed it for free on mintable now we can see that mintable provides a little bit of a different detail and different information uh, rather than the other websites it also provides this check that makes sure that the image has be is authentic and that it is not plagiarized for anywhere it provides also additional tools useful for buying NFTs. I do recommend that you check it out in a little bit more detail. Now let's move on to Rarible. Let's move on to Rarible. Rarible is a amazing NFT marketplace and we're going to sell our animated NFT on this marketplace as well. So to get started, we're going to click on create and we're going to have different options or different blockchains from which we can create our NFT, Ethereum, Tezos and Flow. We're going to go with Ethereum so that we can use our MetaMask wallet. Here, we don't have to create an account. All we have to do is agree to the terms of Rarible and we are ready to go. The next step would be to select if we want to mint a single NFT or multiple. We are minting a single one. Just like with the other NFT marketplaces, there are a couple of options that we can configure for our NFT. They are pretty much similar. So we're going to start with uploading the image or the animated NFT that we have created. We're going to upload the GIF and also we're going to upload the mp4 after that we have the option for the price in this example we are going to be using a uh, fixed price but we also have the option option for a bid or for a time auction just like with the other ones we also have additional information such as uh, unlocking specific contents once the nft is purchased and we can also list our nft for sale with different currencies so that the user can pay in different cryptocurrency. They don't have to use Ethereum to pay for our NFT. Also, we are enabling free minting, meaning that the cost of the minting will be moved onto the buyer once they purchase the NFT. We're also going to add the title, which is always going to be the giant robot in a universe of computers. And we're also going to add a description. Keep in mind that here royalties are a little bit more visible than on the other platforms royalties are going to allow you to get a percentage of your nft as it's traded meaning that in the beginning your nft is going to have uh, once you sell it you will receive all of the uh, all of the revenue of that nft but once that nft changes hands afterwards you will be able to collect 10 percent royalties in this example from that nft once we have added the description and all of the information that we require for our NFT, we are pretty much ready to list our NFT for sale on Rarible. Now, this is going to go through a couple of steps such as it's going to upload all of our information, the video and the GIF is going to upload them to IPFS. IPFS is a decentralized network that is going to be hosting all of the files of our NFT. Remember, the NFT is not your image is not the file it is just a number it is a number that the, after that links to ipfs network finds the content that you have uploaded there and links it to your nft the nft will be way too big if we were to put inside any image or any uh, any video that's why everything is hosted on ipfs while the nft is just hosted in on the blockchain so we are going to have to approve this transaction with a signature so that it links our wallet to our NFT and that it uploads all of the information successfully. So the upload process has been successful. The minting process is being successful. And now the final step is to put our NFT for sale on the Ethereum network on the Rarible platform. So let's sign our NFT. And by signing it, we have successfully listed our NFT for sale on Rarible. 
If we click on view NFT, we will be able to view all of the different characteristics that we have inserted while inserting our NFT. It will take a couple of seconds for the image to load. Here it is. And uh, here we can see all of the different information, including the history of how this NFT has changed hands in the past, uh, in the past transactions. Now, this is it, ladies and gentlemen. In this video, we have created an amazing NFT AI animated AI NFT and we have listed it for sale on three different marketplaces. Now I will check back in a couple of days to see if any of these NFTs have sold. NFT champions, thank you so much for watching. It has been amazing. I love you all and I and I can't wait to see you in the next video. Thank you so much and have a great one.